The Green Business Certification Program is a voluntary program designed to help businesses take basic green measures to reduce their ecological footprint, reduce their energy and resource use, and save money in the process. Earning Green Business Certification indicates that you are part of an innovative leadership movement to green your business operations and help transition to a sustainable future. We saw it as an opportunity to put our money where our mouth is. Uh, we ask our clients all the time to, to do that and we felt like it was uh, appropriate for us to do the same thing. The benefits are, are untold because people these days are looking for the firms that are equal uh, minded and are energy conscious. The program with which we were involved assists the architectural group in helping the building be part of the community. The greening of the side of the building would contribute greatly to the park area that may be being considered for next door and our ability to help participate in that is very important to our firm. As a landscape architect, we're really very much focused on, on green uh, concepts and green energy and, and uh, green sustainable uh, ideas within a lot of our projects. So the certification of our company is very important to us. You know, communities that engage their citizens and their businesses to look at sustainability, these are the communities that are going to last forever. And quite frankly, it's a, it's a nice you know, PR position for your business as well. Uh, we put it on our website and you know, the people we've recommended have done the same thing and you know so people know that you don't just talk the talk you actually you know walk the walk. The Green Business Certification Program offers motivated businesses and agencies an easy to use framework for improving environmental performance. The certification process is very flexible allowing businesses to choose from a broad range of actions. Businesses can also develop their own innovative actions. We collect the rainwater here and uh, actually reuse it uh, for use here in the greenhouse and in the yard. The process is very simple. Uh, it was mostly online and uh, um, we, w we found that we were able to do uh, a lot of this stuff up front. It was simple but it was also comprehensive. You, you have a program that you can walk through step by step, phase by phase in your company's operations, both from purchasing, from energy consumption, from you know, all aspects, water usage, that, that is a prescriptive way to, for, the, for the novice to walk through and say, oh, I can do that, I can do that, I can do that. It also opened our eyes up to uh, opportunities to do things that we hadn't really thought about. And frankly, we were able to do a lot of that stuff uh, easily. The checklist itself was pretty easy to go through and I found out that we are doing a pretty good job already. The process was very easy. Program emphasis is on day-to-day -day operations and policies, making small changes to everyday routines and using effective strategies to save on commercial energy and resources. We won't ask you for a do-over on your green practices. You take credit for practices you already have in place. It helped us emphasize to our staff uh, the value of uh, energy and, and resource conservation, turning off lights, recycling, all the, all the things that are part of the program, but only work if people support them. A lot of the things that uh, were required for the certification we were already doing. We also recycle cardboard on a day-to-day -day basis. The architecture business produces a lot of paper, so we try to use both sides of, of a piece of paper before we recycle it. Look at the simple things that you can do in everyday business and or even home life, to be quite honest with you. The two easiest ones is turn the lights off and, and set a, a set temperature set point for your temperature controls. Uh, 68 and 74 is what's recommended. Many of our 205 green initiatives are free to implement. Many have shown big return on the initial investment. You will find that the program will save on your commercial energy and resources use and could potentially save you thousands of dollars a year. Of course in the business environment we like to save as much as we can and we feel the savings will be there long term. We've um, turned off our sprinkler system on our lawn and we saved about $1,500 a year in water uh, consumption. In a lot of cases it uh, 
it does help save energy and puts more money into our pocket uh, in terms of not using as much electricity or water in a lot of cases. The application didn't cost us a dime. In combination with what we recycle, what we don't use, and the FSC paper, we're saving about $2,500 a year just on paper. In total, with the paper savings and the purchasing uh, savings for doing all the eco-friendly uh, products, uh, both green cleaning products and chemicals, uh, we we've probably have about $14,000 a year in energy and cost savings for the building now. You know, converting everything in the um, in the building to uh, fluorescent bulbs uh, has definitely reduced our, our electric uh, consumption. Usually if there's a will, there's a way. There are a lot of government programs in place that you can take advantage of, and you just have to go out and search and find those. Lighting, HVAC integration, things of those sort, better controls of your HVAC systems, those make financial sense where you can get a 20, 30 percent return on investment fairly easily. As our tagline, you know, it's, it's saving you money while saving the environment. A business that makes the decision to be environmentally conscious will often promote goodwill among potential customers and the community while making the world a better place for future generations. I think it's a commitment to the planet. If you look at the usage per person, we're actually probably at the top. The actual usage and amount of power we use is, is very much on the high side, and the amount of waste per person is among the highest as well. It's wise for us and responsible for us to be able to use those resources in a smart way. Um, just like with any business, you've got resources such as labor or cash. With the earth, we have resources you know, such as materials and what we do with them when we're finished with them. And I think that it's just, you know, um, our duty, our responsibility to uh, treat those materials in such a way so that they're still available for those to come. Going green opens a whole new world of marketing possibilities. One thing's for certain, green gets people's attention. Consumers today are eco-savvy and actively seeking green products and services. Green is cool mm -hmm. and it, it's not a difficult thing for a business owner or, or company to participate in. We want to lead, we feel the environment is important and we want to be a leader in the industry for years to come. Anybody can do it. I don't know why you'd want to not be green because it's it's easy to do, it's, it's, it's responsible, it's what customers are looking for these days. If it's paying you money to be green, why wouldn't you do it?